校的代表，那一位是我们的呃 Dan Dias from Musician Institute and Nico Moore from Savannah and Edra Fossi from AED and Penny Moore from VFS. Hello everyone and welcome. My name is Dan Diaz. I'm the Director of International Student Affairs at the Musicians Institute College of Music in Hollywood, California. And uh, we're very happy to be here with my honored uh, panel. Uh, music or arts is a wonderful career these days. Where more and more students are, and parents are opening up for possibilities of uh, becoming a professional artist, and especially if uh, you know, most, <clears throat> most people are, uh, have had academic backgrounds, but maybe they don't fit the, that type of studies. They're more artistic, and they have a talent. So you have to look at that in yourself or in your children to see, is, is my children academic? Are they artistic and let them express themselves in the way that they're naturally going to because they're going to do it anyways so first of all first of all let me uh, just tell you about I'll tell you a little more about the Musicians Institute College of Music I'm going to play a video for you uh, so let me do that first so you can get an idea of the type of school we are and uh, then I'll talk about our programs afterwards, okay? Enjoy. My time at MI definitely forged the relationships that grew with Blackstar, Epiphone, Seymour Duncan, everyone. It was funny, when I came here, I didn't know a soul in LA. It was like most guys, you know, you just come here to try and figure it out, meet people, start a band. MI was one of the biggest factors in me blossoming into the guitar player I became. Definitely, like, whatever you try to take from the school, like, I mean, you can get anything out of it. Or, like, you know, everything you want to learn is here. It's just kind of in you to go get it. I think the biggest thing that MI has given to me are, um, I mean, obviously the education is great and the knowledge but it's like the networking, the people that I was able to work with. Like I think MI over other schools offers you that almost kind of like that street smart that you need when working in a place such as Hollywood. The Student Support Center helps students and alumni make the most of their experience at MI. It also provides professional development strategies that you'll need to pursue careers in the music and entertainment industry. Whether you're finding your way around town, need assistance with studies, finding a place to live, or even looking for a gig after graduating, this is the place to start. There are six main departments in the SSC. You have career development, student affairs, internship placement, alumni engagement, international student affairs, and housing.
The audio engineering program is a holistic approach to audio that encompasses the technical, business, and production side of the industry. What's most important is to understand the role of the engineer. An audio engineer is a muse between the artist, and that artist might be yourself, and its audience. As an engineer, you are a translator of sounds, ideas, and passions. To approach this, we do a few things here in the AE program. We have fantastic faculty. Many have Grammys, Emmys, multi-platinum hits, and have a complete understanding of the audio industry. We have small classes where the student to teacher ratio is low. You as a student have the ability to book sessions on your own in the studios. We have state of the industry gear and computers. And lastly, MI is a Pro Tools Avid and Logic Certified School, meaning you can get your certifications here, something employers will recognize. So what does this mean? We teach our students as if we're gonna hire you right out of MI. Your success is our success. I am here today in Hollywood, California at the Live House as part of the uh, Musicians Institute. One of the advantages as well at MI with the audio gear here and the mixers is for example, right next to me there's a CL5. This mixer is really the state of the art. So if you do come here, you're learning on a mixer that is used globally accepted around the world as basically becoming the standard. The Independent Artist Program is a six month, two quarter program that prepares the independent artist for the modern music industry. In essence, it covers equal parts artistry, musical development, and the business and marketing side. The one-year, four-quarter artist, producer, entrepreneur program is similar in content, but more in-depth in certain areas and with a few extras included. In IAP and APE, all the work you do in the program is in preparation for getting out into the music world when you finish, not just with great music, but also with promotional tools such as graphics, a fully functioning artist website, and an APE, even your own music videos. We offer music business courses so you can understand the laws of music publishing and contracts, for example, as well as crucial practices in independent artist marketing. You'll also have visual media courses so you can learn Photoshop for things like flyers, logos, banners, the whole nine yards. You'll learn the basics of website design so that you're ready to promote yourself as soon as you graduate or even before. In addition to that, possibly the most awesome thing about these programs is the one-on-one -on -one project advising, where you can work individually with dozens of different MI instructors on all the parts of your projects. And this is just a special feature only for APE and IAP. At Musicians Institute, you can discover your own creative voice and get the training that you need to make your dreams a reality with the curriculum designed by the brightest minds of contemporary music. The world-renowned programs at Musicians Institute help you master the art that drives you. Okay, so now you know a little bit about the Musicians Institute. Our goal is to train talented artists to become professionals in the music industry and work, get a job. That's our focus. There are many uh, career opportunities that musicians can take advantage of. So I'm going to talk about career opportunities for musicians, music composers, music producers, music managers, and audio engineers. There are many career opportunities in the music industry, including musician. This is one of the most obvious choices uh, in the music industry. Musicians perform, they write, they record music, and many of our graduates that you see here have gone on to perform music either originally for their own music or they play in uh, cover bands or in venues all over the world or they become famous themselves and they're touring. Uh, many of them also uh, do studio recording and they're hired musicians to perform in other people's records. Uh, this could be for film, television, uh, 
Network Production。他介绍的是音乐家这个职业，那这是音乐行业最明显的一个职业的选择。那这包含了音乐家表演、创作和录制音乐。他们很多的毕业生呢，都在毕业之后继续表演音乐，无论是原创音乐啊，还是他们去翻唱，或者是在一些呃录音室里面帮别人伴奏。那许多人呢，还甚至就是被雇用在专业的音乐呃音乐室里面，直接就是作为专业的这个录制的。呃，音乐家，那这些呃工作内容可以适用于像电影啊、电视、电视或者是私人的这些歌曲，或者是一些歌手。那很多人甚至也成为了蛮呃知名的一些乐手，或者是很知名的这些歌手。Also, we have we teach you how to be a songwriter. Songwriters create lyrics, melodies for songs. They work for themselves or for other for other artists and publishing companies. There's also music producer, short music producers, uh, music engineers, which are responsible for technical the technical aspects of recording, mixing, and mastering music. Uh, music teachers, lots of our graduates become music teachers. They can work at a school or music academy. Uh, and music marketing and promotions. Uh, Music business management, which take care of the back end uh, of the artist's career, including contracts, management, bookings, those kinds of things. From just from the music artist, we have many other jobs, including like a songwriter. That school will teach you how to write songs, how to write lyrics, how to write songs. They will teach you how to write songs for others or how to write songs for others. 那再来还有音乐制作人这个工作，音乐制作人他负责的是监督歌曲或专辑的录制啊、混音和母带制作。他们跟艺术家的密切合作，也帮助他们有更好的成呃职业的规划。那再来还有音乐工程师，音乐工程师他负责的是像录音、混音，还要掌握音乐的技术面。那么跟制作人和呃艺术家合作呢，确保这个声音有高品质的专业性。还有音乐教师。那音乐教室大家大家很熟悉，就是像音乐老师哦。那这个音乐老师的话，他可以在学校啊、音乐学院工作，甚至可以呃提供私人的课程，教授音乐的理论技巧，帮助学生来发展他们的音乐技能。那还有音乐治疗师，音乐治疗师使用音乐来帮助患有身体、情感和认知障碍的患者，他们制定个性个性化的音乐治疗呢，来满足每个患者的需求，进而达到不同的治疗的目的。这也是一个还蛮特别的职业。那还有像音乐的这个行销跟推广，那音乐的行销跟推广人员呢，透过这个社交媒体、广播和现场活动，各种这些 social media， 呃，来推广这些音乐啊，或者是推广艺术家，有点像经纪人的概念。哦、那最后呢，像也有音乐音乐的业务管理，那这个就比较像经纪人比较全职的工作了，他是负责呢处理艺术家职业生涯的业务，包含合约啊、财务啊、预定。所以这几样呢，都是呃未来我们在 MIT 毕业之后呢，很多同学们从事的不同的工作的类别。Examples of companies and starting salaries.、Uh, there are a variety of companies that hire music composers, producers, including record labels,、uh, production companies, and many others. Some examples of the companies that hire musicians are Sony Music Entertainment. Universal Music Group, Warner Music Group, BMI, ASCAP, Spotify, Apple Music, Pandora, Amazon Music, and SoundCloud. 呃，那边的话就是跟大家介绍一下，说一个范例哈，像他们呢，呃的学生呢，呃被很多的像音乐公司啊、广告公司啊、电影公司、电视制作公司或者是一些视频游戏公司去雇佣，包含了像我们常常听到的一些知名的公司，呃 ，Sony 啊，还有就是他刚刚说的那些国外的公司企业这样子，所以其实它的发展性是还蛮多的。Starting salary for music composers and producers. Vary depending on the number of factors, including the location, the company, the level of experience the person has. In general, the average salary for a music producer is around fifty thousand dollars per year. More experienced producers can make anywhere between fifty to one hundred thousand dollars per year. 
Additionally, music producers who work freelance may be able to charge even higher depending on their level of experience and reputation. 音乐作曲家和制作人的起薪啊更是可以根据他的一些口碑啦或经验然后吸引更多的让他当然收入也会有不同所以这个是在做音乐的这个部分的起薪让大家做个参考。There are also career opportunities for audio engineers. The audio recording industry offers a variety of career opportunities for individuals that have a passion for music. Sound engineers and production, some of most common career opportunities in the industry include audio engineers, studio managers, music producers, sound designers, uh, Foley artists, sound, uh, live sound engineers for live performances, audio equipment technician, and audio educators. 那在音乐工程师的这个职业的部分呢，美国对于这个录音行业啊的音乐音响工程和制作充满热情的人提供了各种的职业机会。那最常见的包含像音频的工程师、工作室经理、音乐制作人，还有像音声音设计师、民音
达到我们刚刚提到的那些职业。Uh, Musicians Institute offers a full range of degrees and a wide variety of concentration in the field of contemporary music, music production and recording, music business, and luthier, instrument building. We have certificate programs from six months to one year in length, and degree programs from one and a half years to four years, and we also have a master's program, which is two years. Our music performance are a unique combination of contemporary music performance and traditional music disciplines. The music performance programs include five major instruments uh, in the study of masters, bachelor, associate, or certificate programs. So depending on how much time and how much money the student wants to invest, they can get a full education and then get a job afterwards. Our instruments are bass, guitar, drums, guitar, keyboards, and vocals. Now Mickey's gonna sing you a song. <laughs> vocals. Uh,在Musician Zhu 哦，那像他们的 associate degree 呢，副学士学位就相当于我们的五专的毕业，所以 M I 它不是只有提供你音乐的专业，也提供你正式的学位课程。We've had a lot of success stories, graduates who become famous or are playing with major artists around the world. Some of our graduates include include、uh, multi Grammy winners such as Anderson Pack, Red Hot Chili Peppers. Band members of Elia, Pink, Christina Aguilera, Michael Jackson, and many more. Also, we have winners of The Voice, American Idol. So please go our, to our website, mi.edu, and check、uh, success stories. And you'll see we've had many from uh, Taiwan, uh, China, uh, all over Asia, and most of our students come from. Here and South America, Europe, we have about a 45% international student、uh, population. So it's, we're mostly an international school. M I 呢，它有非常多的杰出校友，不不单只有这些获得格莱美音乐奖。他刚刚提到的，像大家应该有听到，呃，像 Michael Jackson 啊、Christina Aguilera 这些，他们都是拿过很多大奖的。那甚至美国之声的这个得奖的也是从 M I 出来的，甚至很多台湾的音乐家也都是在 M I 学习过。那 M I 呢，他们大概有百分之四十五的学生都是国际学生，所以是一个非常国际化的学校。那最多的学生来源包括了像台湾。哦，南美洲跟欧洲，所以其实学校的学生，国际学生的比例呢，也是在很多音乐学院比较少见的，它可以融合很多不同的文化，然后呢，又有很多的国际学生，大家互相可以学习跟切磋，这是 M I 他们比较有特色的地方。Okay, thank you very much. 谢谢大家。We'll see you all in Hollywood. 呃，见大家，好莱坞见。